Hey, sisters. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> hey, y'all. I'm Adriana. Thanks for checking out my channel. I was actually just watching a James Charles video where he says sisters literally like I don't even know how many times so it's like stuck in my head now anyway I went to Bath and Body Works this past week bought a lot of stuff a lot of good stuff so they are currently having their semi-annual sale they have it in June like in the summer and then they have it in December so yeah, so right now we're in June, so I wanted to go ahead and do like a haul of some of the stuff that I got. Um, I was going to wait because I do want to go back because there's like so much stuff and then there's stuff at other stores and then there's stuff at other stores and then, you know, I have maybe like four stores where I live and then you have online, but for right now, I'm just going to keep it to this because I don't know if I'm going to do that anymore because I actually just purchased my new MacBook which I'm really excited about because it's definitely going to help me with my channel and all of that so yeah but a shister is really broke right now so yeah I don't even know if I'm going to anymore because yeah I, I really am <laughs> like the Mac just took all my money but um I really needed it my other laptop was like it's, it's just not working anymore and Ugh, it's just such a pain to like edit videos and upload videos because of my lap my previous laptop so it's just a really it's like a pain in the ass so I'm really 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 excited that I have my MacBook now and it's just a relief at the same time it's a lot of money but it's like ugh, like finally but anyway so if you're interested in this Bath and Body Works haul then please keep watching Okay guys, so like I said, this is just the stuff that I bought previous. If I do buy more, which like I said, I don't know if I will, but if I do, um, I'll go ahead and just put it like in a summer haul video that I'll, I'm planning on doing um, just so I can like include it. But I definitely suggest shopping at Bath & Body Works during semi-annual sales. I absolutely love Bath & Body Works. If you don't like Bath & Body Works, something's wrong with you but there's times when stuff is just like overpriced a little bit and they're always having like coupons and sales and stuff but I feel like the best most perfect time to shop at Bath and Body Works and stock up on everything and just do like a big haul is during their semi-annual sales because everything is really affordable inexpensive and they have a bunch of stuff that they've just like collected that they really didn't sell so they'll bring stuff from back from like Christmas or um, just like um, collections that didn't sell they bring back retired scents which is always great because you know how like you go to Bath and Body Works and you find this one scent that you like really love and then like a few months later they're like oh we retired that scent and it's like <sighs> but so they do bring back retired scents during um, this time, so definitely a time to check up on Bath & Body Works, see if your favorite scents are back or if your favorite scents are on sale. It's just it's just a whole bunch of fun. So I love, love, love shopping during semi-annual sales because I can get it for cheaper. So definitely recommend you shopping at Bath & Body Works during semi-annual sales. So let's go ahead and get into it before I start rambling on about something else. I definitely feel like they should have given me like one of those huge bags. They gave me like three little bags and it's like these are heavy. So I got the Country Apple 24 Hour Moisture Ultra Shea Body Cream. Um, I'm going to give you guys like an estimated price of like all of this because I really don't remember. But if I do then I'll tell you. Um, so I want to say these were like six dollars each, but this smells really good it Smells very apple -y. It reminds me of something from when I was little, but I can't remember what got a bunch of hand soaps I love Bath & Body Works hand soaps. My parents have bought Bath & Body Works hand soaps since I can remember And they just kind of like got me hooked on them Which is kind of bad because like now I have to pay for them myself and it's like 
they're expensive like regular prices on these are like $6.50 but these go like really fast so these were $3 the hand slips were $3 I believe like all of them um, so this one is coconut colada it just smells like um, like a sweet coconut smell life is a peach Georgia peach just smells very peachy pretty self-explanatory coconut and ginger with the avocado oil I don't remember how this one smells so this one smells coconutty also but it's more of like a like the other one is more of like a vanilla coconut this one's more of like a fresh coconut like a clean coconut <laughs> if that makes sense and then this is the margarita lime island margarita deep cleansing hands with coconut oil I like um, these that are like actual soaps and you have like little beads in it just because I feel like these clean more than the foam soaps do. <sighs> this one smells so so good. It, it smells like, I don't even know what it smells like. It doesn't smell like margarita. Yeah, it has like a, a pear smell. That's what it is, pear. Definitely pear that I'm smelling. It says lime and sea salt, but I'm definitely picking up more pear. It smells really good. And then this is the Georgia Peach Creamy Luxe Hand Soap. Um, just smells like peach also. And this is the Fresh Spring Garden Creamy Luxe also. Mm, this one just smells very like girly, very pretty, like flowery kind of smelling. Doesn't have the oh, dewy pear apple blossom and cedar so yeah kind of yeah I do smell the pear in this also I'm picking up a lot of pear today and then this is the creamy looks coconut blossom a lot of coconut doesn't smell like coconut at all what the hell um island coconut and tr flower I don't know what tr flower is but all right I think those are all the hand soaps I got so let's move into these um, body creams. So I don't know what collection or whatever these are from, but this is the Peach and Honey Almond Triple Moisture Body Cream. And these were regularly like, 13, so I think they were like either five or six dollars. I, well, I want to say five. Um, I got like two of these, and then this is the Apple Blossom and Lavender Triple Moisture Body Cream same price um and i think i got two of these also this one i also got two of this is the white cosmic cream this is from the fragrance experiment collection um so it's in white i think there's also a black one that's called black yeah these were 13.50 i want to say these were like four dollars but they smell good they kind of sort of have like a more like masculine smell to it but I like how it looks on the skin it's like um it leaves like glittery shimmery kind of whatever's so it looks really pretty on the skin so I really like those I also picked up this true blue spa shea butter super rich foot cream shea it isn't so shister <laughs> I just feel like that was really perfect um this was $15 and I think I got it for maybe like $4. This was like their old packaging like a really long time ago and I was always like looking for it and I ended up finding it so I was really excited about that. This is like one of the best foot lotions like ever. It's like very moisturizing if you have like dry feet. This is definitely um, a product you should pick up. I also got um, this Ultra Shape Body Cream in Honolulu Sun. This smells really pretty. I want to say this was like four or five dollars um so yeah it smells very like tropical it's coconut pacific palm ocean air accord sun drenched citrus white sand musk so yeah very pretty like um tropically smelling you guys this one is probably like oh, my favorite like i'm obsessed with this scent right now like nuts like I need to go buy more for sure I didn't think I liked it that much like you know when you go into Bath and Body Works and you smell something in the store and then it's like oh it smells so good and then when you get home it just doesn't smell the same well I've had that with the I think it's the midnight pomegranate shower gel I was like oh this smells really good 
and they were like three dollars each so I got like three of them I actually didn't like how it smelled once I got home I was like this doesn't smell the same and I was just like oh so I'm kind of like cautious as far as that unless I like really love it and I just I should have gotten more of this I don't know why I didn't so regular price on this is $13.50 I think it was four dollars or five dollars this is the watermelon lemonade 24 hour moisture ultra shea body cream oh my gosh This smells so good. This smells like some kind of candy from when I was little. Oh my gosh, this smells so freaking good. If anything, like, I don't have money right now, but if anything, I'm going to go back and get, like, more of these because I just love how this smells. And I also, okay, yeah, see, here's the black one. So, this was also part of the fragrance experiment collection, and this is in black. And this is a mousse to oil. Oil? <laughs> Um, so it's kind of cool It comes out as like a foam This was maybe like three dollars So some of this I just got it because I was like oh It smells really nice. I wish it had like the same thing as the the like lotions Where like they're shimmery, but it's not but It's just a nice oil to have just to kind of like oil your body up. This is the rainbow body oil in marshmallow magic um so this has vanilla cream crisp lavender and marshmallow musk so it's like three different oils i don't know if you can see it's like three different colors this white at the bottom pink in the middle and then like blue on the top and yeah you're supposed to like shake it together and then just rub the body oil over you i really love how this smells i'm not really like a big vanilla sweet like super sweet scent person but I actually really like this it smells really good doesn't necessarily smell like marshmallows um, I'm definitely picking up more of like a vanilla musk kind of smell it's not like an overbearing like oh sweet vanilla it's just it smells really good I think this was maybe like four dollars regular price was 1850 super overpriced i would not pay 1850 for that and i think this was also like part of the same collection because this is also in marshmallow magic so this is the super sculpty soap for your body and you guys like i kind of just bought this like just because um this was 1650 i think it was like three or four dollars so look This smells really good too it smells like the body oil and like literally like you can play with it and like mold it and like just do different things with that it's very childish i guess but <laughs> it caught my attention and i don't know why like i really like it but it really does smell really good it smells exactly how i just described the body oil it smells really really good and then I also did mention how sometimes they will bring back like Christmas collection stuff so they did bring these back um, and I had bought these or bought this one before and I actually really liked like the shimmeriness that it left on me so these are shimmer fizz body lotions this one's in vanilla bean noel and this one is in twisted peppermint and these are part of the Christmas shop collection so look very Christmassy but um yeah they're like really pretty i definitely like the vanilla bean one more just because it doesn't smell like peppermint and when i think of peppermint i think of like christmas this one definitely smells more christmasy than the vanilla one because vanilla isn't necessarily always you know associated with christmas so that's what it looks like once it comes out of the bottle sounds pretty crazy but I love how it's shimmery now these aren't like the super like most moisturizing products in the world but they are um, they are really nice and shimmery I don't know if you can see that I'm getting like major deja vu right now. I'm like zoning out, that's why. I'm getting like major deja vu. Okay. Now you can see. 
but they both smell really good i just like i said i feel like peppermint is more associated with christmas than vanilla is so i'm more comfortable using the vanilla one like year round so yeah and then the last product i have in here i think this was 16.50 i remember tearing off the tag earlier um, and this was three dollars. So this is from their active skincare um, collection and this is the bronzing DIY tan customizable self tan drops. So this is it. Um, I definitely love to tan. I love to just be all glowy and darker and pretty and um, I have tried my fair share of tanning lotions, tanning sprays, um, and all of that so I was like oh let's see if this works so okay um, it says it's liquid sunshine and these customizable self tan drops to your favorite oh add these customizable self tan drops to your favorite lotion for immediate color while also gradually building your perfect glow so um, it says it's made with aloe mano manoiola <laughs> Manoy oil and vitamin E. So the directions say to mix four to six drops per palmful of lotion. Apply to body as usual. Wash hands immediately. Wait until dry to dress. Blah blah blah. Use daily to deepen color. So it's just like um, there's just drops that you put into your lotion. It says, and you just apply it. You know, just wherever you want to get tan. So. I did apply it last night it did add like a gradual tan to me I'm definitely gonna see if it builds up a little bit more I like this because it doesn't smell as strong as like some of those other tanners do you know like the any kind of tanner you get is going to have a smell to it and this one does have that same smell to it but it's not as strong and I don't know if it's because you're mixing it into like something else so it's not as bad but I do really really like that about this because I really hate that smell like it just bothers me and I just feel like I need to take a shower and then I just wash off what I put on myself so yeah I actually really like it so far definitely going to see if it does build up um, I don't know it doesn't like give any information as far as like does it wash off right away like is it gonna how long is it going to stay on me which is something that I didn't really like and I can't even find it on the website I don't know why um, because I remember seeing it the other day when I first logged on to Bath and Body Works website and I was looking through their stuff I remember seeing this online and that's why in store it caught my attention and this was the last one in store so I'm kind of like did it sell out is it did they like call it back I don't know like it's weird <laughs> because I can't even find it online anymore so um yeah I just I haven't had the time to like give this a full review and this is like the only thing that I feel like I need a full review because everything else is just lotion hand soaps you know stuff like that so that is my haul of the stuff that I have bought from Bath and Body Works this past week like I said I wasn't planning on buying my MacBook this week but it just happened that way and so I was planning on buying a lot more stuff so I don't know the sale does last I think from to, uh, it lasts until like July 5th or something like that I'll like make sure to put a date or something here so if I'm giving you false information I can correct myself but yeah that's all the stuff just love Bath and Body Works like I said I recommend you shopping during their semi-annual sales because I feel like that's when you get the best deals I mean like lotions for three dollars four dollars five dollars um it's better than paying $13, $16, $18 on some of the stuff. So, yeah, I'm really happy with everything I got. Like I said, the only thing that I kind of need to test out a little bit more are those tanning drops. But it did intrigue me and I am interested in stuff. So, we'll see. But, yeah, if I do shop more, I will be sure to include it in my, like, summer haul or something. Because I also wanted to get candles because, like... 
there's some good smelling candles that I smelled the other day. Well, that's it, you guys. Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. If you liked this video, please remember to like this video. And also remember to subscribe to my channel to help me out. Help a girl out. Hit that button. Um, and if you have any questions, comments, or anything like that about any of the products that I talked about, you can always ask me down in the comment section down below, or I will also leave my social media at the end of this video so you can, you know, ask me there, or follow me there, or stalk me there. And, um, yeah. I think that about covers this video. Thank you guys again for watching my craziness. <sighs> And I hope I see you next time. Bye, guys.